Sorry, I think I just got disconnected. No, so as the session was over because of time limitation. Okay. So the um, session, then, yes. Yeah, it's Einen um, for Correct. invest in the article, then Correct. Einen, and again, it's. Rest, everything plural. remains same. Yeah, plural is, um, yeah, let's say. Everything remains same. The only difference we have is in masculine, that's it. Yeah. Just everything remains same. Okay. And okay, Naija, please give me dative articles. Okay, uh, dream, de, dream, einem, einer, einem, de, uh, den, den, den. Correct. Thank you. These are my dative words. Okay. Let's talk about our possessive pronoun. Let me before copy my personal pronouns here. Oh, that's okay. Quick revision of everything. These are my personal pronomen. And Pinkle, what you were referring to initially, possessive pronoun, this is what we are doing now. So we have possessive okay. pronomen. This is our base form. What we learn here is base form. So what is the base form of possessive pronouns? Mm -hmm. Make sure. No, um... that is the personal pronoun. Okay. Mm -hmm. Which is the personal pronoun? Mine, thine, yeah. Correct. So, Mine, thine. Um, and let, let us elaborate a bit. So, Z, S. Yeah. So, air. Yeah. Sign Z ear S sign via Unza ear Oya Z. No, is it this also in masculine, feminine, and neutral? That's what, but these are the base forms. Islamica, this is the base form. It's okay. And what you're talking about is the case form. This is the base form, those are the case forms. Here we are going to do in nominative. This is my Nominative, you are right. Nominative, accusative, dative. Okay. What you are referring to, Naija, is this one. So we have masculine, feminine, neutrum. Okay. Okay, so. All right. So, Navda, can you please give me all possessive pronoun forms for nominative? Uh, minor, diner. No, you're wrong. What it's was wrong. the logic? What was the logic behind this one? What masculine and neutral are the same and feminine no that was not the logic Viva. that was not the logic so which article do possessive pronouns follow all the time the indefinite article you remember ein am i right yes. they always follow no. indefinite article so if this is ein the possessive pronoun will be Ein, if this is eine, this would be I meine, mine, meine, mine. There is nothing after ein. There will be nothing after mine. Same. Okay. Yes, Navda, please complete the list. Uh, dein, deine, dein. Mm -hmm. Correct. Sein, seine, sein. Mm-hmm. Your, 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 your,
correct um, so because this is ainan so it would be mainan dainan dainan zainan iran zainan unzaran oiran iagaran iaran correct yeah. and feminine would be same as um, nominative nominative wonderful yeah. thank you navda oh naija sorry please do the dative dative article is main dein sein ihr oh dative in pashtim baba acha sorry einem einer einem correct so it will be meinem deinem seinem ihrem seinem unserem eurem ihrem ihrem then meiner deiner seiner ihrer seiner ihrer eurer ihrer ihrer Mm. And then again, my name, thy name, thy name, your name, thy name, unzir, unziram, oiram, iram, iram. Correct. This is what our Odessa pronouns are. Let's talk about our next part, which is prepositions. So this compact grammar sheet is going to be with you all the time. Prepositions. How many prepositions do we have? Cases. Accusative, dative, vexil. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Pinkle, can you please help me with accusative preposition? Any any special acronym you have uh, learnt it? No, not yet. Um... But, but we have done it using a special acronym. You remember, okay. both of you. What was the acronym for accusative prepositions? Uh, S. So have we done? S N A M V A G. बेटा वो dative का था ना? नहीं जब वो dative का था accusative. So have we learned as God buffet or dog buffet or bofudge? Remember, forgot. Gegenan do. Restesh. So it is it was gegen. Ona, duash, bis, om, fua, and lang. This is our accusative. So what is the acronym for this one? Is God buffet. God buffet, and what Naija was talking about, it was snam bag. Correct, Naija? Yes, this, sir. This was you mentioning. So this this is the acronym to remember dative prepositions. Snam bag, ZV. Inkal, any guesses what this preposition could be? I remember. Yeah, go ahead. Zaid. Zaid. Uh, knock. Knock. House. Mm hmm. Uh, mid. Mid. By. House. Again, you ba. Su. Yeah. Su. Fon. Fon. Correct. So, Pinkle, you can you just learn these acronym. to okay. remember these prepositions so s stands for zaid n stands for nak a stands for aus and so on so forth in that it this one okay what was the acronym for vexel navda was that sunu hawai navda you forgot Yes. Sir. Yeah. No problem. Sunu Hawaii. Okay. So Z stands for. Swishen. Unta. U stands for unta. Yeah. Neben. Then. Uber. Uber. Hinta. An. For. Auf. auf in. in. Correct. These are the prepositions which we have in. german grammar so let's have a quick meaning of these prepositions what could what would is gegen stands for pinkel 
what does gegen stands for not sure because i think i did not cover all of them on any okay this. gegen stands for against opposite okay owner is without so anyhow we are going to cover the same thing in a2 as well okay but you are aware okay. of these uh, basic terms right um yes the welshian one um, i'm completely aware um, bexel bexel yeah, bexel okay. um, but i think uh, some of them from the accusative and dative i haven't read uh, maybe i would just check on that yeah no problem see but i mean uh, these words came across when you yes, were learning yeah yeah okay so i mean these prepositions are a challenging for even b1 b2 participants so it's it's not a surprising part they don't that you do not you know uh, uh, you're not aware of cool yeah. 